Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you are all doing really well. We are back on the Jesmonite this week and I am so excited because as you know, I have been working in collaboration with Polysil UK and they have sent me another amazing bundle and some new pigments. Oh my gosh. So I no longer have just the primary colours to play with and make my own colours from. They have sent me. These are not new to Jesmonite, they are new to me code now this is a brand new color to me this is not a brand new color to jesmonite and i am excited oh my goodness it looks like gold like a brownie gold i'm so excited to try this one terracotta pots i have got a love for terracotta pots although i don't use them much because they soak up the water but yeah i'm super excited about that one and they sent me red oxide but to have three new colors I am, I am excited. So what I thought I'd do in this video today, I thought I would run through all of the colours because I now have all of the pigments that you can get in the pigment range for Jesmonite. So what I thought I'd do is I would do like a colour chart just to see what they look like with different varying degrees of that pigment being put in. I am going to show you every single colour in the pigment range for Jesmonite and we'll see what they look like with one drop, two drops, three drops that kind of thing. I hope that makes sense and I'm so excited. It's gonna be a messy one so let's get going. I am not gonna talk through the whole video but what you will see me do is put one drop of the colour in, I will mix that and then I will add a second drop, then I will add a third drop and in some of them I ended up adding four drops you will see as the video goes the only color I would say needed more than most is the yellow oxide I feel like that is not as pigmented as some of the other colors but for the majority I will be adding one drop followed by two drops on top followed by three drops for the final color I will then come back at the end and talk a little bit about the colours and my absolute favourite colour to date that I have just discovered.
hope you have found that really, really helpful. I'm just going to talk to you now about these brand new colours. This is the whole colour pigment range that you can get with Desmonite. Now you can be brighter, so the green for example, you can get that even brighter by adding more green. And the red and the blue, of course, you can have really bright blue, brighter than my gloves if you add more pigment. You just need to be careful not to add too much pigment because then that can hinder your Desmonite curing. It will take a lot longer and you might have some sticky spots left over. But I need to talk about these new colours. So this is Code. Code is without doubt my most favourite colour that I have had. I mean, it is absolutely stunning. It's just so earthy and I love these tones. What I'm going to do next, my next video is going to be some ombre. Now someone asked me if we could make ombre with jesmonite and I know it's a lot harder, it doesn't flow like other mediums, but I am going to attempt some ombre pots using this colour because look at this colour guys! I am head over heels in love. So here is the terracotta, again gorgeous neutral earthy tones and I absolutely adore this colour too and the red oxide honestly really love the floral feeling to them almost rose color in the pale and then going into the darker shade just adore them well i hope you really enjoyed that video guys as much as i enjoyed making it now if you'd like to just pop on over help me clean up <laughs> The cleanup is real right now. Anyone who's done Jasmine Night knows the cleanup is real. So if anyone wants my address, just uh, I've, I can give you gloves at the door <laughs> when you come in. Anyway, I hope you've really enjoyed it. I've loved creating all of these and it just goes to show how little or how much pigment can change the look of your piece. I'm not putting them all back in order for you right now because, yeah, let me know which one is your favourite. Look at these tones. Look at these tones. I cannot get over them. They are stunning. I cannot wait to make more videos using these new colours that I've got. My newfound love, I think code i think code might make an appearance in uh, a few videos to come but anyway let me know which one's your favorite and if you've enjoyed this or if you found it helpful for your jesmonite journey then just drop a comment down below and don't forget to like subscribe do all that jazz and yeah thank you so so much for everyone's support you're all amazing and i will see you all in the next video bye